Double Dragon. It's your boy, Amen. It's your boy, like it. We back with some new heat for y'all today. Like I never left. You heard what she said. Let's go, man. Feel the saga. Episode 20. Dang, it's almost over. It's crazy, bro. I'm like kind of sad, though. Yeah, it's, pretty, it's a pretty uh, decent series. Yeah. I feel like it should have like been over like seven weeks ago. Yeah, they had. You know what I'm saying? They but had to I ain't complaining, you know. They had to Shoot. postpone postpone some weeks and stuff like that. So it's cool. It sucked when it was happening, but then again... We still got it. We still reacting to it in December, so it's not no problem. Facts. But yeah, last episode, man, we seen three people unite, or two people unite, with Canute, Thorfinn, Askeladd group, and then Thorko and his army. Yep. So that was pretty dope to like be able to see. Now we about to see like them like fight together, bro. Thorku is probably literally the strongest person That's like in the army as far as like right now. And Thorfinn, we all know, is a freaking prodigy. You yeah, know what I'm saying? That's true. And like Askeladd, we've seen more of his power, like, but this is about to be this is about to be crazy. I don't I think the king gonna take some time to like get to some get to the king. Yeah. And if we even gonna fight anybody or like are they gonna get like a messenger to like figure out that we kinda joining forces or the king right. gonna send out some type of assassins or there's like so many different things that can happen. So I'm trying to see how they gonna make this whole little uh, combined forces actually work, so Exactly. And I'm wondering like if they're gonna just introduce somebody new to them. They have to have like I know they got the um Jorms little Vikings uh name. I know they got the leader of that dude. I'm not really yeah. worried about him. The guy so looking dude. You gotta have somebody else because I know the king is like old, fragile, got old people bumps and pale. I don't see him doing anything but <laughs> getting killed sitting in his throne, to be honest. So, yeah. Low key, Canute probably can kill him. I'm just saying. <laughs> But yeah, it's about to be crazy, but I don't see nobody stopping us. We're about to go in here and freaking Molly Wap the King, take over. I wonder if they're going to teach him Canute a couple moves, something, to be able to go kill his daddy. Because I feel like it's only fitting if he dies from from either yeah. either Thorfinn or Canute. Because Thorfinn, low-key, he actually sent the hit out on his dad, low-key, from, from, from a far reach, of course, but... True. Yeah. So one of them, or they probably do a combo kill. Who knows? Yeah. Maybe. Uh. What if Canute run into his brother? You think he think he gonna? Uh, oh, his kill? brother. His brother's probably gonna be the person because because he's yeah. supposed to be like a a warrior, but they ain't really said not a lot about him. Exactly. I would think that they say 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 like more about. Maybe they just hold them hold them back to like saving for the end. Yeah. That's uh, what I'm thinking. I don't think. I still want to see how um. How Thorko takes the news about uh, Thor's dying. Oh, he found yeah. out the truth that Askeladd was ordered to, uh, mm -hmm. got paid to kill him. I wonder what he gonna do. He probably gonna ask, how is he able to kill him? That's what he gonna ask. Cause he gonna be like, bro, you beat Thor's? Freak out of here. Like, I wonder if that, if that, if that just even comes up. Like, I, yeah. I, I don't know. I feel like if it comes up, judging by Thorko. He might kill Askeladd, bro. He loved Thor's. I think he's gonna be mad, but I don't, I don't know. Him, bro. I don't know. And then, like, when is he gonna find out? Gonna be like the worst time, or is it gonna be this episode? I thought he's gonna find out last episode, but right. he still ain't found out. But he did tell Canute about um about his uh uh what's that dude that got killed? It was Canute's uh, uh Overwatch, I guess. Ragnar. Yeah, what? he did tell him. That was the perfect time to tell him, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that was, that's crazy. But yeah. But yeah, man, I'm ready to get into it. Let's see how the rest of the story unfolds. All right, let's run it up. Floki. Oh, so they know. The force of truth is actually be disrespectful. Yeah, I want to take the news. It's impossible. He just switched from saying that to 
We here already? So we gotta be healed up, then. Yeah. He said, wanna fight? <laughs> he got the patch over his eye. Restrain yourself. Oh, he sent it? With spears in hand. He can't believe it, but. <laughs> you deaf, motherfucker? D, we here already, G. He's let them through. <laughs> Facts. Talk to him. Games world. Still popular among the warriors. Men ties with them. <laughs> he like I'm out. <laughs> He's like free bill. Okay, yeah, brother. Oh, dang, not even here. This is a good opportunity. <laughs> Talk to him, Dorfin. Dang. Wow, that's deep. <clears throat> Willing to turn into a demon. Putting all on his back. How can he even trust Askeladd, bro? Probably don't really. Strong freaking door to take them in two people to freaking open them. He mad. I hope Thorfinn arm okay. Because he might need to fight. Twenty of them. But he asked, he asked Thorfinn, bro. Mm. He's trying to assassinate this dude or something. He's like, nah, bro, stay back a little bit more. Can he see him? Askelato. Informally. Oh yeah, walk ten steps. Face change. Mm. You're a troublesome child. I wonder how much time passed. Enough for them possibly to heal up. That'd be a month or something. <laughs> Loki. Will of the crown. To kill me? I knew he was gonna say free. Mm -mm -mm. Dang. The crown does not want you. They drew their swords first. Mm. We don't want that, bro. If I read the Bible, confuse you. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Told that man to reconsider. Continue. <laughs> oh my gosh. Talk to him, ask a lot. What's your daddy name? Mm. Mm. Talking about his mama. Hold it together. <laughs> he told Knut to do it. <laughs> He's like, like oh, he's like, oh, oh shit. He never seen Askeladd like this. I wonder if he's gonna use that later on. Don't get closer, pimp. Bro, Askeladd's about to kill everybody, bro. Practice what you preach. <laughs> Slave to the crown. Dang. I must be wary of him. Dang. He got a kid on his <laughs> Is that the freaking monk, dude? That's crazy. Did he get a haircut? That ain't. That is crazy. He needed it, bro. Right. <laughs> How old? 23. 23. Talking about love. He knocked him over. He knocked him over. <laughs> he probably want to now. It's a mind game now. Oh. You know, killed his brother. <laughs> いいで。そんなところで。かまわん。むしろ。おかごり。You changed. Especially with his brother did. <laughs> They got splints. Dang! Do it, fam! Bro, next time you fight, ask about. Hey, look at that Oh my god. Hey, man, what's going on, bro? Send them away. Thank you. Surprised they even came with us. Right. <laughs> this man is not the same. <laughs> oh, yeah, what's B doing? Intestines. <laughs> Gotta be quicker to <laughs> say, have a good life. <laughs> Shoot fly don't bother me. Oh, that's fam. Still looking for Thorfinn. This man been aging and aging. It took him a whole season to find us. <laughs> he trailing though, he trailing. I wonder how what Thorfinn gonna think when he sees him, bro. Hopefully he able to remember him. He got he got old as heck. Facts. Telling all your stories and stuff, man. He better not come and try to be like, all right, Thorfinn, time to come home. Like Thorfinn yeah. gonna be like, 
I got some stuff to do, fam. It's pretty surprising them being there already. And we ain't had to take no detour episodes, you know what I'm saying, to get there. So we got the intensity right. We pretty much got right to it. That was pretty yeah. dope. Yep, and it's interesting, man. I'm seeing Oscar lot like that, bro. Thor about somebody's like, mama is over with. Facts, bro. Don't talk about my mama, bro. <laughs> A different kind of energy mm -hmm. come out. <laughs> Sorry. Dude, that, that was crazy. But Canute with his strategies, like, coming in, like, you could definitely tell, like, he, like, has that king type of mindset, mm -hmm. being able to delegate and stuff, like sending Thorfu to mend it, mend his uh, relationships with the generals or the armies, ask a lot to come with him, Thorfinn to come with back up, and all of that. Like that whole little like session of him giving out them orders was like dope to watch. Bro. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But yeah, man, I'm enjoying it, man. I wonder how long it's gonna take for us to like finally kill them. I feel like it's gonna be a mind game, kind of yeah. like. I mean, he pretty much got him went over most of the uh, the army, I, I guess, again, show yeah. everybody that he changed. The brother dude does seem kind of sketchy because his brother dead now, so he kind of really don't got... Gunner? Yeah, like, yeah. like, like yeah, so he might he might probably turn on him. That's because I said it. That's because I know, bro. He be knowing some stuff. He was just like, he don't think he going to be loyal to the prince. He's like, well, I can take my hats off to uh, the freaking, like, um, to ask a lot this episode, too, for... Not killing them dudes at the end. I would have murked them dudes. Yeah. Sorry. It's over with. Mm -mm. Yeah. Don't play that. That definitely took a whole lot of uh They ain't gave them gold energy. on top of that. But but then that one I, Oh, I, them dudes. Yeah. Okay. I, I kinda that. I kinda feel like the dude he gave the gold to, I kinda felt like he had more sense. And he didn't have and, and he had, kinda had no choice but to follow his brother. Cause that's you know, blood. I don't think he ever would I I don't think he ever I don't think he would have turned on Oscar had it been his his decision, not his brother's. Yeah. And then it kind of felt like karma got his brother because now his brother like brain dead now. Exactly. So I guess it kind of worked out because like maybe Ascalot saw that it wasn't really him trying to like uh, to, to uh, turn on him pretty much. Mm. So I guess that's why he didn't kill him. I mean, yeah. Uh, I guess you got You got it. You got to go with blood at the end of the day. You got to. I feel you. And I think it's cool. It was the right decision for them to leave. Oh, yeah. I don't know how much time passed since we got united and since we made it here. Yeah. But, like, I feel like they should have left before that. Or not even, like, followed them. I came with us. Like, don't, exactly. come out, don't, don't come here. Like, you turned on them, bro. Leave right there when everybody's leaving. You leave, too. It showed heart. Ask a lot. But he gave him, not only did he give him gold. Yeah. But he also gave him gold as far as, like, Wisdom, like, bro, don't pick up a sword, bro. This is not for you. Go and live a life. That's great. Have a family and all this stuff. And then gave him gold at the end of the day. If Thorco still don't know the truth about Thor's, I'm starting to think he might have a, like, he might just accidentally come out when him and him and Thorfinn have a moment together. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think they had no moment together yet, so I don't know. Thorfinn reason why he might not tell him is because he probably would think Thorco going to kill him. He And Thorfinn want to kill him. Yeah, it's, it's possible. Or, or you probably just don't really care about it because it happened so long ago, and he not really putting two and two together. Mm. But yeah, I'm pretty sure if it comes up, he'd be like, "Oh yeah, he did it." Right. But don't worry about it. I'm gonna kill him later. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But but it, yeah. It's almost like I, I, I still feel like it's just hard to kill Asgard's character. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's literally gonna be hard to kill his character. Like I'm, I'm probably thinking he's not dying. So probably like end of season two. If he dies, it's gonna be three. like a season ending death or something. Like yeah. a like yeah. a big moment type thing. I'm not and I don't think like I feel like his character is too like if you take Ascalot characters out character out, I guess that just leaves like Canute and you know, Thorkel and uh, Thorfinn. Like I feel like it may it spreads it way, way too uh thin. So I feel like he's gonna kinda survive in the second season. Yeah. Yeah. Probably not die at all. Who knows? We're going to see, man. I feel like he might ha also have an alternative alternative plan to Canute. Like, do you really think that he 100% following Canute? I feel like following him is probably going to get him what he, what he kind of wanted. Because he did tell the dude, uh, I forgot back where his, his mother's from. He told him about his, his, his kind of like his ultimate plan. So right. I feel like uh, he think following, uh, you know, uh, Canute. Canute 
is, is uh, definitely gonna deliver that. Especially having a discussion with uh with the with the uh, Ragnar uh, dude as well. So right, yeah, he already got summed up his sleeve. Yeah, facts, bro. Facts. Yeah, it's, it's weird. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be nothing against Canute though. I think it's gonna be some 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 different. Like maybe like uh making them like allies to like the West Ains. I think they call. I can't. I can't oh, remember yeah, what they call. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I know. What you're yeah, because that's what he promised them is to actually join, join, join forces and stuff like that. So, I think that's his main goal. Or oh, he, he's saying that he wouldn't allow them to like touch them or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, so it's like the allies. Yeah, you can't, you can't, you can't do nothing to them. But I also feel like Thorfinn has to kill Ascala at some point, bro. <sighs> at some point, he has to, bro. It's like, it's like, yeah, that's supposed to happen, but I feel like the more time keep going on, Dorothy can like kind of play like he still hate him, but he low key care about him. He care about him. He want him to stay alive for him to, for his, so he can. No, I'm him. saying like that's that's understandable, but I'm yeah. saying like over time, he's like growing more and more closer to Asquire, bro. Hey. I mean, it's inevitable. That's how it always happens. It's inevitable. If you spend time with somebody, like, you're going to yeah. grow. But, like, at the back of your head, but you're going to be like, this dude killed my dad, bro. Exactly. I mean, yeah. I can't. I, I think he has to kill him, hopefully. I, I want mean, him to kill him. He's pretty much supposed to uh, happen. I kind of don't want him to die because, like, he just has a lot of value as a character. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He just kind of brings a lot of value stuff. Without him... We probably wouldn't have got through a lot of stuff, bro. Right. And that's why at the right time, I want Thorfinn to kill him because he's basically he's a cage. Like use him and then kill him. He's basically a cage for Thorfinn, bro. Thorfinn can't live his life with Askeladd around. Like, Thorfinn, Thorfinn wouldn't have became the badass without him. Bro, Thorfinn, Thorfinn has that in his like, genes, bro. Yeah, he has it in his genes. He would have so still daughter. be cold. Thorfinn... Thorfinn would not have became a badass without without him. Okay, that don't Probably mean that, would be dead. That don't mean that I should not want him to kill Askeladd. No, no, no. I'm just trying to like show you that Thorfinn became himself because of Askeladd. Right, and his self is it. not really that good. What do you mean? You don't think Thorfinn cold? Oh, you talking about as far as his skills? Yeah, like just his skills and just who he is. The character that everybody loves is because of Askeladd. I feel like his skills are high because of that. But I feel like his his mental and stuff, he, he's he's caged in. Like, is he's limited. He doesn't... I feel like he don't have the right... That caged in built his skill up. Right, but, like, what's more important? What do you mean? You like, think he's going to beat Askeladd with his, with, his, with his mental brain? I'm saying he wouldn't have to... Bro... This dude, Jeans, is from Thorku and, and freaking Thor's. Just because his father, like, if his father would still be alive, like, he would have just trained with his father and still got cold. He probably wouldn't have trained with his father because his father wasn't about the sword no more. He was he was all about farming. Or he would have, or that would have been, okay, that would have released him to be able to have, bro, this dude, the fact that he's chained in, in my eyes, I feel sorry for Thorfinn. Yes, he's cold, <laughs> but like he literally has no purpose just following this dude waiting for the perfect time to kill him. Like that's not a life to be proud of. I think. Can control it. I mean, so based off what you're saying is you think Thorfinn uh would have became this cold fighter because he has the genes of his father. Yeah, I feel like it's inevitable that he would have been cold. So why why is the canoe cold then? His father we didn't even know his father can fight. His father can fight? His, his his father probably could fight because his brother can't know that his brother can't see him or his brother fight. But they said that his brother is a great warrior though. In their eyes, a great warrior to them is probably somebody. Canute average. is not a great, not a warrior at all. Shouldn't he have some type of warrior type of skill, something, be able to hold a sword or something? We didn't see none of his father or brother fight, so I can't say that Canute should be cold. And we know that they're not that cold because even them saying Thorco name, they know that he's this type of that nobody can beat him. So like, we know he's not at that level. His brother so, or that. So it stands that if you got the blood of like a Thor, then you should be cold. 
like you know, if they're based off the. I mean, the, a the, the, high the, percentage yeah. chance of a time. Like if you have that gene genetic, then you should have something to be able to. I disagree. I mean, genes could come out wrong. You could your father could be the best NBA player, and you could come out with no NBA skills. That's yeah. that's that can happen. But I'm yeah. saying. If you living under that type of presence or you have that type of gene, it's more likely that you can possess that that gene as well. But he wouldn't be living under it though. Like he's with his father, but it's not the same father that Dork will fall with. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. It's a whole different mindset about taking care of your family, raising your cattle, and living like a peaceful life. That's it. Hey. But yeah, man, I won't I don't throw him to get freed, man. Once <laughs> that happens, I'll be. So you think Ascar got to die in order to be free? For him to be free, yeah, because he's the one who was responsible for killing Thor from dad. Killed his Not dad. the king. Hmm? The king. Ascar knew he knew something was up when Floki came to him, like, but he still took that mission anyway because of the money and because of, you know blah blah blah. So. The reason the person who killed him, I don't care like who sent him, they could die too. But like Askeladd was the reason why that whole that put that traumatized Dorfin. Seeing what Askeladd did. I don't care who sent him. That ain't gonna erase my mind from seeing what Askeladd did to my dad. Okay, but you do remember Askeladd kinda uh gave up and said that, that Thor is one and it was really Bjorn that kinda did it. Cause he grabbed Thorfinn and then they was able to get the shots on him. No, they was all scheming. The but Thor I'm saying, like, he was already like, okay, man, you got me. And there was no way that they was getting out of that until Bjorn got, you know what I'm saying, Thorfinn. No, I think we might have to rewatch that because I believe that Askeladd was still thinking that that was going to be something shady going to happen. That he wasn't just like, because if, if he would have gave up, he's the leader. He would have told them, let's go. So, I feel like something close around that kind of happened where, like, he he kind of conceded. Okay, so if he's the leader and he conceded, then it should have been, he should have died. What do you mean? Oscar, I should have said, leave him alone. He beat me. Let's go. But if but if we're on the same team and I see an opening, I'm going to take the opening so we can have the higher advantage. Hey. He can't control Bjorn. If you're the leader, you got to be able to control your people. But... I'm not about to stop somebody from giving us the advantage. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, like if that's what you're saying, like, like, you like it. you pinpointing this all, like, even Thorfinn, because of course that he was there, but Thorfinn not understanding that it was so many things that trickled down to to one in his father's head, and it was the king. That's the main person that sent it out. Had the king not sent it out, his father still be alive. That's the source. Okay. All right. John Wick. John Wick. What, what happened? happened? They killed this dog, right? Yeah. He could have. He could have just killed the people that killed this dog, right? And just lived on his life, right? But what he do? He went and went after the main boss that sent out the hit. Okay. That's the main person that that started. You know what I'm saying? To kill Thor's. That's the king. That's the real murderer, right there. Okay. Did anybody ever explain that to Thorfinn? No, but I'm trying to tell so you that's why, that okay. that that shouldn't uh that's not gonna free him because it's still the main person that ordered the hit out on him. It's still alive. It's gonna free Thorfinn. That's not gonna free him. Cause he doesn't know that the king sent the hit out. So he, he believes You don't think he's gonna learn that? Does he know it now? We you don't think he's only, gonna learn okay. You can only go off. Do you what think Thorfinn's gonna find out about Thor's dying? Possibly. Okay, you don't think it's a possibility that he gonna find out about the king he can. sending the head out? He can. That's what I'm saying. Okay, and that's fine, but the so whole premise... he gonna find out, then he gonna be caged again. Because now you gotta kill the king. No, because they probably gonna kill the king before he end up having this fight with Askeladd. I think he gonna find out before the king die. I mean, it, that's not a... It just, it, just always, it, it just seems right. If it doesn't happen, that's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. What you mean? That's kind of crazy. Because it's kind of like it's like you never really see like the, the the person that really murdered your parent die before you find out. You kind of always find out, and it's and it's really the person like that kid always kills kills that person. You know what I'm saying? Right. 
Yeah, so like I kind of don't see him not finding out before the king die. But yeah, we don't know. But as far as right now, me looking at it, Thorfinn believes Askeladd is the reason for his death. He is whatever percent you may think it is, maybe 10% and then the king 90%, but he has some partial percent in his father dying. So in I'm my not saying eye, he don't have no he don't have no no fault for it. I'm, I'm just saying oh, okay. who like the originator is. So Thorfinn needs to kill Askeladd. I know you like Askeladd as a character. Everybody loves Askeladd. I like Askeladd as a character. I like I like all the characters. There's not there's not really no characters I don't like. You know what I'm saying? But this whole season of premise is like Thorfinn finally getting a chance to like revenge his father to kill Askeladd. And if they just abandon that, then it's just like it will suck, but it will also mean Thorfinn is maturing up, maturing up. You know what I'm saying? His mentality has changed. So if he don't kill Oscar, I would respect him for it. But if he do, I wouldn't be mad if he did. Okay. But yeah, man, this is a dope episode. You know what I'm saying? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you check these videos out on Patreon before you put them on YouTube. Facts. We'll see y'all again next episode. Double Dragon out. Peace. Deuces. Okay, like,